Hey guys, guess what? I uh, got my head tracking working and I thought I would show you how I did it. Do you remember this thing that I showed you in one of the previous videos? Yeah, well, that's a piece of crap. So, I went on to Hobby King and I got the uh, X Gyro 1000. Yeah, it was really cheap. It was only $38. Alright, so, with that said, let me show you how this thing works. Alright, here we go. I have, now I have, instead of 7 and 8, I have the camera set up on channels 5 and 6, which is the gyro and flap channels on the TH9X over there. Remember my beautiful backlight screen. Here is the gyro. And if you turn it sideways, it looks left and right, look up and down. It looks up and down. We center it up, down, up, down, left, right, left, right. Let's take a look at the radio real quick. Okay, here it is. And look how easy that is to read now. Um, I did a modification to the back of my radio. You can see there's a wire coming out. What I did was I permanently soldered this connection into the radio. To make this modification, you're going to have to open up the case again and go to the back of the transmitter, drill a hole for the wire to come through, and solder a few connections. The black, red, and green wires from this plug. Then, set the settings in your radio. Set up your TH9X. You go to Trainer. And turn your gyro and flap to normal and the state to off. Okay, so <clears throat> you go down to your aux channels. And you set channel 5 to hover pit and channel 6 to hover throw. And that's all you have to do with your radio. This one wasn't easy, so for more information, please subscribe. Up, down, up, down, left, right, left, right. Here's a tip. On Hobby King, if you stare at their pictures long enough, they'll offer you a discount. Stay on the product for like one, maybe two minutes, they'll give you a discount. Up, down, up, down, left, right, left, right. That does it for now. Please subscribe and comment your butts off.